name is Dave Clement. I'm the quality manager at Arlington Plating. Uh, my job here is to assure that our customers get the proper plating that they require for their product. Now, how do we determine uh, the proper plating for a part? Uh, two things. One, a customer will either give us their a print that has what they want plated in their, their specifications or they'll actually give us detailed specifications that'll tell us you know, what they require as far as the amount of plating, the amount of plating of different nickels, uh, steps, whatever they require, and that's what we'll do is follow along with what they need and that's what we'll put on the parts. Uh, well, this, this test uh, checks the electrical potential and also the uh, thickness at the same time. And, um, as the testing is going on, the, the report is printing out on the chart graph, and from there, once the testing is done, we actually read, read the chart and uh, record all the proper thicknesses and make sure that it adheres to our customer specifications. This is our uh, X-ray fluorescence machine. It's, uh, it's an X-ray for doing thickness testing. We line, align the part up, and it's pretty simple. Once we tell it what the substrate is and what material we're testing, um, it goes through, does the testing, prints up, gives us our results, and then we, we compare that to what our customer specifications are to ensure that we have the proper thicknesses. This is our, uh, what we perform here is a reverse saw test. What it is, is the most severe test for adhesion. We actually place a part in the saw. We, uh, one of our customer requirements is that the blade has to be uh, 12 teeth or less per inch. And um, anyway, I'll, I'll just run this through. We'll show you that uh, what we do for adhesion testing. facing down so the, the blade actually pulls against our plating and the, uh, the idea is to see if, if, uh, if any of the material is, would peel after this. And as you can see it's, it's just a great test. Um, it's just a little burrs here but this is the, the plating itself adheres as it should. This is our bacon quench test. It's one of our uh, adhesion tests. Uh, what we do is we place parts in an oven for for a length of time at a specified temperature by our customer. Uh, and after the length of time, we'll take it out and actually quench the part in, uh, in ambient water, which is a pretty severe test. It kind of shocks the part, and if we have no blistering or anything else, uh, we'll know that we have a good solid part. our coker step test where we do our microporous semi-bright and bright nickel thicknesses as well as our bright to semi-bright steps. We at Arlington Plating strive to 
to make a superior product. We work with our customers. We're in constant communication with them. We're doing testing throughout the day, all day, and even into the evening. Um, again, our, our goal is to make our customers extremely satisfied with what we do with our, with our product, with our delivery, and we strive to give them the utmost of uh, satisfaction.